now. Shelby County now has its first case of the coronavirus. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Ariana Poindexter. The Shelby County Health Department confirms one person tested positive for the virus this weekend. Right now, that patient is getting treatment in isolation at Baptist Memorial Hospital in Memphis. Tonight, WMC Action News 5's Brandon Richard shows how health officials are working to track down people who had close contact with that patient. Well, just days after state leaders confirmed the first case of the coronavirus in Tennessee, city and county leaders gathered here at the health department to confirm the first case in Shelby County. The coronavirus has arrived in the Mid-South. We have our first confirmed case of novel coronavirus in Shelby County. City and county leaders say a lab test sent to the state on Friday came back late Saturday and showed a Shelby County resident tested positive. I want to point out that the individual is recovering, doing well, and receiving care at Baptist. Because of patient privacy laws, they can't share many details, but say the person recently traveled out of state. That the patient is in good condition. Dr. Steve Threlkeld with Baptist says the patient is being treated in an isolated hospital room. Hospital operations continue as usual uh, and we're taking all the necessary and appropriate steps to make sure that all of our patients, our staff members and our visitors are, are safe. Health leaders say they're working on a timeline of the patient's travel and are trying to track down everyone he or she came into contact with. The health department says letters will be sent to those people letting them know they need to self-quarantine. We will identify everyone who's had close contact with the individual that's a case and assure that those individuals have information that they need, but also that they're quarantined for 14 days from the last contact that they had. They caution there is no risk to the public at large, but urge anyone with flu-like symptoms to stay at home and limit their exposure to others. In Memphis, Brandon Richard, WMC Action News 5. County leaders say they have been in contact with the governor and say samples have also been sent to the CDC for additional confirmation, but they don't anticipate any change in the result. Memphis Mayor Jim Strickland and Shelby County Mayor Lee Harris says the city and county stand ready to help in any way they can.